Welcome back, you young punks. Welcome to the Young Punk Shortcast, where we are talking about great conversation in a short amount of time so you can get back to your everyday life. Today, we're going to be talking and jumping straight into our subject. How much time are you willing to waste? And I want to talk about this because we live in a generation in a time where it seems like everybody, and I mean everybody, okay, is not willing to waste their time anymore. Has this trend caused us to be very short with people or short with situations that we probably should have stuck out? Have you ever found yourself in a situation that you thought back and you said, man, if I just would have stuck this out a little bit longer and just waited instead of saying, hey, I put too much time in, I'm done with this, the outcome might have been different. This can be for various things. It could be relationships. Um, Maybe it's a business venture. Um, Maybe it's just taking care of something, taking care of your house or something like that. It could be anything in our life. Are we too quick? Do we want results now? Are we willing to wait? I know a lot of times with our with our spouses, or maybe you got your girl, or your boy that you that you've been dating. Uh, a lot of times, if there's something that goes wrong, or if there's any hint that there may be something off here, we're dashing and we're running from the situation because we feel like, hey, I ain't trying to waste my time. It is what it is. This person then wasn't upfront with what they were saying that it was, what the relationship was going to be, and they doing their thing. Has there been any times in your life when you approached a situation you were like, man, maybe I should have gave that some time after figuring out the true facts of the situation? Um, I know there are some times, like, especially in business, uh, maybe you're starting a podcast, maybe you're doing content creation, or maybe you just have a business out or a service that you offer out to the world. Have you ever found yourself found yourself wanting to give in or throw in the towel because the results that you thought would happen didn't happen overnight? And I feel like a lot of times we decide to give up based on what we're seeing other people do, right? Um, we throw away the idea that our time isn't somebody else's time, right? Some, so somebody else's blessing, it may come in a certain amount of time, and we think ours should come the same way, right? But oftentimes we lose sight of that our blessing is held up for us till a certain point and and it's delivered at the right time exactly when it's needed. Are we looking and discarding things and not waiting long enough because we think that it should be manifested in a certain amount of time? Um, I want you to to think about these things. This, This shortcast is meant to Think about these things and then come back and answer um, right in the comments below. Or you can maybe you can answer a little bit later on as you th- to continue to think about it throughout the day. Think about: um, Am I short with my time? How much time am I willing to waste before I say, "Okay, dude, this is not producing anything"? And that might be true in your life, right? A lot of everything that we do is not going to be peaches and roses, even though society makes it seem like that everything that you're going to do is is going to succeed. Hey. I came to tell you that most of the things that you try, they're going to fail. Are you okay with that, bruh? Are you going to hold your head down because, hey, I put in all this time and I put in all this work and it didn't work out? Well, so what? That's a part of life. There's going to be many situations in our lives that we're going to say, man, I put in a lot of time and, bruh, these fools don't waste my time, okay? Or, hey, I spent a lot of money on my business. Maybe you might have spent your life savings. I might be talking to somebody today that might have spent your life savings on a certain idea and it and it's not working out. Like, you're, you're sinking into the Titanic. There's no boat for you and Rose to get on. By the way, she, Jack could have fit on that boat. I don't care what you say. If you disagree, your mama weed dry. I, judge, judge them. Don't judge me, okay? He could have fit on that boat. But anyway, maybe your ship is going down and you're like, man, I got to jump off this bleed. But but a lot of us will willingness to, to take more time and stick it out a little bit longer because we are worried about what other people are going to say. Oh, look at all this money. I told you so. I told you it wasn't going to work from the beginning. And it gets us down. Are we willing to waste more time because we're so enamored with other people's thoughts and what they're thinking about us and the decisions that we make. And are we scared to be a failure? 
I had to learn that was being scared to be in a failure, being scared to waste your time. And a lot of it is a pride thing, right? Um, a lot of times it's, it's about us. Like, man, I got too much pride to go out like this. But sometimes we do need to go out like that. You've been wasting your time too long. Let me know what you think. This is our, our, our short our short cast discussion today. As always, I'm your boy Berserker or Levi. You can call me either one. It both is fine. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that way you stay posted to everything that we have going on on this Young Punk cast. I'll catch you, Young Punks, later. Hey, have a blessed day. Stay up and think about, are you wasting time or should you stay in it a little bit longer so that way the success that you're looking for in your relationship, in your life, in your business, whatever it is that you have on your heart, that it can be manifested at the right point in time in your life. This new cat? I catch it. Yeah, man. Berserker? Yo, it's, it's the Berserker. No, and this, this man is going crazy. Show me the